Welcome back to the channel. Today, I wanted to show you what you could expect from LATAM Airlines economy class on their 787-9 from San Paolo to JFK, flight 8180. Please follow me on Instagram at BrandonJohnson10K for behind the scenes looks at content that I will be reviewing in the future. So economy class on this aircraft, as you can see here, it's colorful. <laughs> the seats are colorful. I guess the further up you go to seat, the hotter it gets, right? Anyway, you've got a 3-3 configuration uh, throughout economy. And again, I've flown the 787-8, did a review of that of a much shorter flight. Um, but yeah, this is a long haul, my first long haul in economy with Latam. And, and boy, am I excited because I got seat 43L, which is the very last seat um, on the left side coming up here. So um, yeah, I'll be last to get off the plane but surprisingly i was able to this is probably the best sleep i've gotten in economy on any economy flight i've ever flown so i don't know if that was due to the seat or just tired uh from andre my son <laughs> but that mixture that combination helped me sleep so i guess i'll have to uh, make sure that's the case going forward here so you get a pillow and a blanket here more on this blanket in a second this is the best economy blanket i've seen and some headphones are in that packet as well um, you got the sliding headrest that can you can adjust as needed on the back of the seat there nice in-flight entertainment screen here here you've got the classic latam tray table that flips out in half and you can unfold it to get you the other half of the tray table um, here you got a little pouch there um, as well as you got essentially two windows to to view uh, things out of the window with you do have a charging port below here. It did work, thankfully. This was a full flight, so I did have a uh, seat mate as well. And you do have individual air vents on the aircraft, so that's always a plus. Here you can take a look at the seat pitch. So this is how far the seat goes back if you're interested. So pretty, pretty decent pitch. The leg room was okay. And here's this blanket. Yeah, this is, I don't know what it is about this blanket, but yeah, I really enjoyed it. Uh, again, the best economy blanket I've experienced to this point. So I will leave you with the takeoff and talk about more on the flight shortly. Thank you. back let's look at the bathroom on the 787-9 and you know me i was definitely looking for a a window in here but no window so yes standard bathroom some nice floors <laughs> so that's about it with the bathroom uh, meal service choices were beef or pasta i chose the beef um, this also had green beans, onions, and potatoes with bread on the side, and then alfajor for dessert. Um, the potatoes were dry, but the rest of the meal, the meal, the meal wasn't bad. It also had a beverage service as well, but that is the dinner service there. Uh, for breakfast, you could get a sandwich or eggs. I had the eggs, so that came with the potatoes, uh, tomato, and the yogurt. Uh, it was okay. Breakfast wasn't bad. I mean. Still, my favorite meal is the salmon on um, that I had on a past Latam flight. I'll leave the link for that. And I'll leave you with the in-flight entertainment system to peruse through that and 
check out the options you have there. No Wi-Fi on this flight, by the way. Okay, welcome back. Um, let me give you my final thoughts on the flight. Uh, again, comfort wise, I was pleasantly surprised. Uh, not that there was a ton of legroom, but I was able to sleep, I think, six and a half to seven hours very well on the flight. That was impressive. Uh, Love the blanket, yeah, best blanket I've had in the economy. Uh, interested to hear your thoughts on that if you've had flown Latam long haul and experienced that blanket. Um, the food was just okay. Um, nothing going to blow you away there. Uh, as far as the service, uh, flight attendant was uh, very pleasant. Uh, I think I've seen this particular flight attendant on another flight and uh, she's yeah, very attentive uh, in the economy cabin. So uh, that was my experience there. No Wi-Fi. You do have the in-flight entertainment screen. And yeah, that was really it for my experience on the TAM flight 8180 from Sao Paulo to JFK in economy class on the 787-9. As always, I appreciate you watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and share this with a friend. I will catch you next time. Thank you.